G'day guys, Source here for Reg TV. We're out at Downlands College for the final day of the 2019 State Champs. We're here with Chairman of Downs Rugby, Mike Warren. Mike, obviously it's been a great couple of days of footy, mate. How much have you been impressed with the level of play and just the crowds that have been out here at Downlands? Well, it's been an absolutely terrific uh, three days of rugby. I mean, this is a real demonstration that rugby in Australia, at the grassroots and community level, is just going so fantastically well. It's a great news story for rugby. Um, and to see all the young boys here over three days, some pretty testing conditions and beautiful weather for the final couple of games. But prior to that, a bit of drizzle, a bit of fog, and all sorts of things you can expect in rugby as a winter sport. But it's been fantastic. And the crowd, well, we reckon there's been probably two and a half, three thousand 3,000 people here. Uh, almost every day. Um, it's just been a terrific festival of rugby and to see the uh, talent that's there and the skills that are there and all the volunteers, the coaches and managers and referees, it's just been great. Now I'm here with Troy Simpkin from the BJU who's going to be the head coach of the City Under 16s. Troy, obviously BJU mate, sweeping the grades today, winning the Under 13s, Under 14s and Under 16s mate. You've been impressed with the talent on show mate? Uh, yeah, the talent on show this weekend has been amazing, uh, especially even from the countrysides as well. Um, it's been a really, really good weekend of football for junior footy. And mate, obviously there's a long process that leads into the state champs. How much work's going in behind the scenes uh, to get the BJU sides ready for the, for the state champs? So there's been a lot of work put in from all the coaches on uh, obviously all the region sides. So we only have North and South in every age group this year. They've been out watching football games plus a trial day, um, six weeks of training leading into the tournament. So it's been a big, big amount of preparation. And obviously now the city and countryside's face off at Ballymore this coming Friday. Uh, how, how special is it for these kids to be able to represent city and play against what's going to be some pretty strong countrysides? I think it's really big for them. I think uh, for these kids, it is the pinnacle for them. Coming through the BJU system, this is as high as they can really get through the city in, into the city team. Um, and these city country games are always massive. Country don't come to mess around, they come down to play some football. So it's going to be a really, really fun afternoon for, for all the kids involved. Now, mate, on a personal note, you're obviously still pulling on the boots for GPS every weekend in Premier Rugby, mate. Um, you've come through the BJU system. Um, how awesome was it for you as a player to go through it and now to give back as a coach? Yeah, mate, it was great fun. I, I enjoyed all my time here. Some of the guys that coached me are still here coaching as well. Um, but it feels great, uh, personally, to be able to give back to junior footy and, and come down and coach and help out the young guys and, and give the knowledge that I've received to the younger kids. All right, now I'm here with Izzy Armstrong of Vula from the victorious under-16 BJU Red side. Easy, mate, obviously it's been a tough tournament, backing up each day for plenty of games, mate, but to come through with the win, mate, how special was that? Yeah, it was very special, yeah, proud effort from the boys. Yeah, a lot of hard work put into this. Yeah, it meant a lot to everyone. Yeah. And obviously, mate, a lot of guys come from different clubs around Brisbane. How much of a challenge is it to get everyone together and playing for that same goal under the BJU banner? Oh, uh, yeah, at the end of the day, we all wanted to win. Uh, yeah, we're all a, a big competitive bunch out there, and yeah, we just all mingled quite nicely, and yeah. One of the one in the yeah, mate, it was a tough match against the Gold Coast side. I know you guys led 7-0 heading into the second half and they really took it to you, but you came through, got to try the end to secure the win, mate. How special? Yeah, yeah it was very special, yeah. Something I'll, yeah, I'll never forget. It was good fun out there. All right, folks, that's it from out here at Downlands College for the 2019 Queensland Rugby Union Junior State Championships. It's been a really special event, made possible by the hard work of the staff from Downs Rugby Union and all the other regional centres around the state. Special thanks to the players, the team staff and the parents who've all come along, taken part and competed in a really great tournament.